And, of course, Tajay Spears played his high school football at Ponchatoula. Well, Willie Fritz was ready to move on after the school announced Tuesday that he was staying as the Green Wave football coach. Fritz said Tulane football has momentum and must do everything it can now to keep it. Tulane head coach Willie Fritz led his team through practice Wednesday morning, and then he hopes answered his last questions about his alleged flirtation with Georgia Tech. I didn't think it was going to have to be, but it uh, ended up that way. You know, it's yeah. So I'm, I'm hopefully it's <laughs> not going to be bugged anymore about that <laughs> stuff. I don't know. Fritz said he didn't want this Saturday's American Athletic Championship game to be a one-off. He wants this game to be a common occurrence. We want to uh, we want to be able to do this consistently. You know, and I've, I've talked to some people, and they they want to they want to get this going. Obviously, I'm busy, so I'm not. You know, but at some point in time, you know, we need to sit down and hey, here's some things we can do to to to, to keep the momentum. A facilities upgrade could be a huge part of that momentum. Tulane is in dire need of an indoor practice facility and expanded weight room. You know, I heard your story the other day, and you talked about that as well. Yeah, there's mm -hmm. some things we, we, we'd like to do. I, you know, I just... Can you be specific? Well, there's a, you know, there's a bunch of things. I want to talk to the, you know, the powers that be about those things. And, and, uh, but I, I, I know everybody's excited, and they can see what mm -hmm. athletics can do for the university. And, and, uh, and we, we want to you know, be a real positive part of uh, Tulane. Fritz said his football team has represented themselves and the university well. It's not like that every place. Some people think it is. It isn't. One of the good things about me is I've been a lot of places. One of the bad things about me is I've been a lot of places. <laughs> and you can watch the Green Wave live here on WGNO and ABC. Tulane in Central Florida, 3 p.m. Saturday, right here. And Coach Fritz says he's been a lot of places, but he's staying here for now, which is great news, Ed. When you look at, and Tulane, pardon the play on words, is on a roll here. They mm -hmm. kept their coach. Let's say they win uptown, which I think they will on uh -huh. Saturday. You talk about the things they need, the practice facility and other things. How much does all of that go forward and help that well, happen? Well, you know, look, hindsight's 2020, but I said it back in 2012. I would not have built Yulman Stadium. I would have spent $80 million on an athlete's village that's absolutely first class, an indoor practice facility, a state-of-the-art weight room, and continue to play downtown at the Superdome. But you know what? That didn't happen. The stadium's here. It's not going away. But you still need to spend 50 or $60 million 